In this video, I'll show you how to connect your Epson Workforce Pro WF4820 and 4830 to your internet network. So let's get started right away. This is the main menu of your printer. If you're not seeing this, you need to press on the house icon over here. So you get on the main menu screen. Then the third option from the top over here, you see there's a Wi-Fi logo. Press on it once. You're going to have multiple options. We need to select the first one. Wi-Fi recommended. Start setup. Select Wi-Fi wizard, the first option. It will scan for all the Wi-Fi networks around you. So at home or if you're at the office, it will select if it will show you every single network that are around the printer. And now we just have just like on any touch screen to go and select your actual Wi-Fi network from this list. Now it's time to enter the password. Go down, press on enter and type your password. If you have numbers in your password, press this number button down below to switch. Once you're done typing the password, press OK and select start setup. Wait a few seconds or sometimes even a minute. Make sure that the printer is in the range of your Wi-Fi network. At the end, you're going to get this blue check mark saying that everything is done properly and that, and that the printer is now connected to your Wi-Fi. If there is a firmware available, an update available for your printer, you're going to get the screen right away. And I suggest you install it. So press OK. It will ask you if you want to register to Epson Connect. You're not obligated to create an account, so I'll select No. The update will be downloaded in the background. This is so Epson improve their future products by getting your usage data. If you don't want Epson to have access to your data, simply press reject. And this is it. Your printer is now connected to your Wi-Fi network. 